Where is he? He should be here by now. You should really stop meeting like this. Sorry for the short notice, but I wouldn't trust anybody but you. That's what super friends are for. So why are we out in the middle of nowhere? Look, this cannot slip out, but I have a daughter. And long story short, my father-in-law is now sportsmaster. He stole the child a few nights ago, and I tracked him down to here. Great and all, very shocking, but I don't see a secret base. Follow me. What I do in here is for my daughter and her safety, so do not let it define our friendship. Hey, there's nothing that you can do to make me think any less of you. Let's get going. Stop right here. Two tangos, both armed. No problem. Hey, wake up. What were you doing here? What's going on? Don't hurt me, man. All I know is this creepy guy in a hockey mask told me to guard this secret door behind me. Thank you for the information. Wait, 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 wait what? Ah! That has to be Sportsmaster. Get ready. We have no idea what's going to be behind these doors. The room's empty. Hello, gentlemen. Glad you could make it. You psychotic piece of... Oh, hold the compliments until you're face-to-face -face with me. Well, if you ever get the chance to be. <gasps> Shot. What are you doing here? Wherever the money is, I'll go. Do you even know who you're protecting? I could care less. Any job that lets me kill you two is worth it. Now, are we gonna fight or what? Finally, something we can agree on. No, this is my fight. It's about time I finally just get my revenge. Bring it, bird boy. <laughs> Stay with me. No. No pulse. Come on. No pulse. I'm sorry, but you'll thank me later. Speedy? Why is there an arrow in me? It doesn't matter. We gotta keep moving. We don't know how far or close Sportsmaster really is. Hey you! Stop right there! Alright, let's do this! Nice of you two to finally join me. I was starting to worry. You know, I brought you out here to first see if you were a good enough husband for Cheshire. But I also wanted to see if you had what it took to be a great father by doing anything for your child. And I have to say, I'm pretty impressed. I bet you know all about being a great father. Give me one reason not to shoot you. Because I'm pretty sure you wouldn't want your best friend dead. Now, I want you to drop your weapon and fight me hand to hand. If you win, you keep your life and the child. If I win, I take your life and the child. It's like they say, a father would do anything for a child. Huh! 